It's NCAA Retro Bowl Mania time. We've got a great one for you today. We've got the Chanticleers of Coastal Carolina taking on Navy. Let's get straight to the action, folks. Should be a good one. And Navy kicks off first. And Coastal Carolina's got the ball, and they're moving the ball down. And they get to the red zone, and they score first with a touchdown. And wow, the crowd here at Annapolis here is suddenly grown, uh, how should I put it, quiet. And we've got first down, B.J. Nada, the quarterback, gives it to T.J. Swain. Wow, and only a one-yard carry right there. Nice tackle. We're going for second and nine right now. And Swain with the handoff. Oh, a nice tackle there, I think. Wow, I was going to say he lost a yard, but no. Actually, he gained nothing. And we've got a third down and nine and long right now. Oh, but just like that, Swain gets through and gets 11 yards and gets the first down. Wow, and they moved the chains. Oh, and Swain bursts through and he gets four yards right there. And now we've got a second down and six. Swain, oh, had daylight for a second, but all uh, real quickly it closed up. We've got third and four. Oh, what a hit and knocks them back for a one-yard loss. Wow. And they're going for it right here, folks, on fourth down and five. There it is. Oh, and he missed the tackle. He breaks it. And he's to the 30, 25, 20, 15. Oh, and he misses. And there it is. Touchdown. And we've always talked about that game-breaking speed right there. They held him in check for the entire time. And then all of a sudden, he broke it. A broke a long one. And your midshipmen are up. 8-7 to seven right now at the end of the first quarter. And Carolina answers right there with a field goal. And Coastal's up 10-8, to eight, and Navy's got the ball right now. And it is first down and 10 at their own 44-yard line. Swain, oh, and Swain breaks it! And he's gone, there he is! The 40! The 30, the 20, the 10, and just like that, they had them bottled up, where they had them tackle for a couple of uh, tackles for a loss, then all of a sudden, within a few seconds, they end up getting to them, or um, thinking they had them, and unfortunately, Swain breaks it and goes for two long ones. And you blink, and just like that, Navy's up 16 to 10. Uh-oh. And the Annapolis crowd is not happy right now as Navy is losing. 17 to 16 right now, with only 58 seconds left to go in the uh, first half. There's another handoff. Oh, oh. And Swaim only gets to the uh, line of scrimmage there. And then we've got second down and 10. Oh, and Swain with a stutter step and gets about five yards, and they call a timeout. And we've got third down right now. And there he goes. The tight end broke free, and he's going to have to try to get out of bounds. And he gets out of bounds and saves the time as they have 31 seconds left to go in the first half. Oh, and Swain goes absolutely nowhere right there. We've got a second down and nine. Let's see what they get right here. And there it is to the other tight end. Oh, but the other tight end fumbled. And Coastal gets it. And they run off the time at uh, halftime. And they go into the locker room with a 17 to 16 lead. Wow, this is a shocking one right here, folks. Navy better get it together uh, real soon, 
or else they're not going to like the outcome. There's a handoff. Oh, and a one-yard carry, and they've got second down and nine. And there you go. Give it to Swain, but Swain gets it outside. And Swain, he breaks it. There he goes. Oh, and a 27-yard carry right there. Wow. And he's uh, gone over 100 yards here with that carry. Uh-oh. There's a carry right there by B.J. Nada. Goes for nine yards. He's uh, been quiet so far this game, but he stepped his uh, game up for that one. And there it is, first down, six-yard carry. And that's a 21-yard line right now. Gives a Swain right there. And Swain, four yards. Brings up second and six, and they are in the red zone. There you go. Nada keeps it himself. And he gets out of bounds. I think he's got the first down. Yes, he does. And they are at, let's see, the 11-yard line. And they're looking for a, oh, three-yard carry. I was going to say a TJ Swain uh, specialty, but it didn't work right there. Second down and seven. Nada, there he goes. He's taking off. I think he might get to the end zone. And he gets in. With the eight-yard touchdown. And now Navy is up 22 to 17. Uh oh oh. And they brought everybody that time. And they stopped a two-point conversion, and Navy's in trouble. They're only up by five. And Coastal kicks the field goal, and they're only down by two points. We've got a great one here today, folks. And here we go, first down and ten. And they call an audible. Swain. And Swain, he breaks the tackle! And there he goes. Oh, 15 yards right there. And it's first down and 10 at the 39-yard uh, line. He breaks through. There he goes again. And I believe, let's see if he got the first down. No. And it is second down and in inches right here. And Nada, there he goes. Nada, he gets around and gets 11 yards right there. And it's... Once again, in the red zone, and Nada is stepping his game up this uh, this game as they're really needing his uh, production. Oh, and there's a stiff arm. Oh, but the third person comes up and gets a tackle, and at the end of three, it's only a two-point uh, game as Navy is up 22-20. to 20. Uh-oh. Oh, and a five-yard carry right there. And it's going to bring up third and four. This is a very crucial um, possession right here. Oh, and they go for a quick pass. And they get the first down. The first, or is it the second pass of the game right there? And they mixed it up a bit. And here we go. Nada. Back to pass. And he keeps it himself once again. Oh, and he gets clobber right there at the two-yard line. Uh-oh, and we're in a goal line stance right here. It's second and goal. Oh, and Nada takes it to the outside, knowing that everybody was clamped in the uh, inside right there. And he's got a touchdown, and now it's 28-20. to 20. He's going to look to try to uh, put this one away here if they get this two-point conversion. And Nada keeps it himself, and he gets in, and it is 30 to 30-20. Looks like this might be it, folks. Navy kicks it off to Carolina. Carolina goes for the field goal, but they're going to need to get that ball back in order to get that last uh, possession. And I don't know if that's going to happen. And here we go. Oh! But since they're up, they try something different. Right, Culkin! And Culkin's out of here! He's taking off! The 20! The 10! 5! And that's it, folks. 71 yards for the touchdown. Lulled him to sleep right there. 
And what a great uh, play call right there. Nada has been getting after it. There's a two-point conversion, and it's 38-23. to 23. And, folks, I think that might be it. Oh, and there's a turnover right there. And they've got the ball, and they're going to go for it. 17 seconds left. And they call an audible. And what are they going to do right here? Quick pass right there. And they get out of bounds. Only three seconds uh, off the clock. And here we go. Second down. Oh, and not a breaks it. He breaks it again. What a play. And he gets in. Wow, and all of a sudden, a barrage of points right here. A game which was 22 to 20, suddenly in the last quarter, ends up 44 to 23. And Nada's going to go in, and he's in for the touchdown. And folks, that's it. Your midshipmen go on to win this 146 to 23. What a dominating performance in the fourth quarter. And they really played like champions. And they said Taylor Swain really had an outstanding game. He has an outstanding game every game here. So let's go on and get ready to take a look at the stats. Swain, 218 yards in the game, which is excellent. All right, we're getting ready to level up our tight end. And yes, we uh, level it up the coaching staff here real quick. And the offensive lineman is back, which means the running game is going to be even stronger. Let's take a look real quick. Stats. BJ not a 7 of 7 for 103 yards. Pretty good there. And he also provides 38 yards of rushing. We're moving on to the man, the myth, Taylor Swain. 22 carries for 218 yards right there. And four touchdowns. Thielen, the uh, tight end, his second reception of the uh, season. Wow. And then we have right receiver, Jonah Culkin, which catches three catches for 82 yards in his 16th uh, reception right there. Wow, great game by Sidney Shaw. Devontae Vander was on point once again. And so is Marcus Guy. And, folks, that's it. Another dominating performance. I can't wait to see what's next for our Navy midshipmen as they are looking better and better, as they are looking to head towards the uh, playoffs pretty soon. So on that note, we're getting out of here. We're just going to say uh, anchors away, and we'll see you next week on NCAA Retro Bowl Mania.